Well, it appears Tiffany Hatter is relishing the situation regarding Common's relationship with Jennifer Hudson. Oh, he never gave me no damn earrings. He probably gave those to Jenny. Allegedly, Jennifer ended things with Common in a messy and embarrassing manner, leading to Tiffany mocking him openly. Tiffany, who had been critical of their relationship from the start, seems unfazed by Common's plight and is throwing shade at him with newfound pettiness. Common and Tiffany dated for about a year during the pandemic from 2020 to 2021. Initially, Common portrayed the breakup as mutual due to their busy schedules, but Tiffany claimed she was blindsided, emphasizing the strength and joy of their relationship. She suggested Common had commitment issues, implying he might never settle down. When Common began dating Jennifer Hudson, it seemed promising, with reports indicating he was more serious about her than previous relationships. Once Tiffany and I got back on the move, it, it really didn't allow for us to spend as much time and put as much energy into our relationship. I don't think the love really dispersed. I just think it was just like, we weren't feeding the relationship. However, recent reports suggest Jennifer might be reconsidering the relationship, possibly leading to her rejecting Common's proposal. This How are you dating anyone? <laughs> so, yes, and I'm in a relationship that is one of the most beautiful people I ever met in life. And she's, she's smart, she loves God, she has something real down to earth about her. Um, she's talented, but but I set I set my standard kind of high because she had to have an EGOT. She, she 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 had to win an Oscar on her first movie. I set my standard high. She had to get her own talk show. Oh, okay. Yeah, so. <laughs> this rejection seemingly stems from Jennifer's past experiences, notably a tumultuous relationship with David Otunga. Jennifer and David's relationship, which started as a fairy tale, soured over time. Allegations of domestic violence and infidelity surfaced, resulting in a messy public split. Jennifer accused David of abusive behavior while he denied the allegations, claiming concerns about responsible parenting. Jennifer's traumatic past involving gun violence adds weight to her reluctance to make things official with Common. Despite his assurances of commitment, she may fear another broken marriage. Tiffany Haddish reportedly sees this as karma for common, given their past relationship. Fans appear supportive of Jennifer's decision to be cautious, noting Common's history as a heartbreaker. Some express skepticism about Common's sincerity, urging Jennifer to remain vigilant. As the situation unfolds, opinions vary on whether to support Common and Jennifer's relationship. In summary, the saga involving Common, Jennifer Hudson, and Tiffany Haddish continues to captivate attention, with each twist revealing more about love, betrayal, and the complexities of relationships. Continuing the narrative, the unfolding drama surrounding Common, Jennifer Hudson, and Tiffany Haddish keeps the public intrigued as new developments emerge. Despite the setbacks, Common remains resolute in his pursuit of Jennifer, seemingly convinced that she's the love of his life. However, Jennifer's reluctance to fully commit reflects her cautious approach, shaped by past heartaches and traumas. The scars left by her tumultuous relationship with David Otunga serve as a constant reminder of the potential risks of love. Meanwhile, Tiffany Haddish watches from the sidelines, reveling in what she perceives as Common's comeuppance. For Tiffany, who claims to have been hurt by Common in the past, witnessing his romantic misfortunes brings a sense of vindication. Her unabashed mockery and shade-throwing add a layer of intrigue to an already tumultuous situation. As the public follows the ups and downs of this celebrity love triangle, speculation runs rampant about the future of Common and Jennifer's relationship. Will Common persist in his efforts to win Jennifer back? Or will Jennifer's apprehensions ultimately drive them apart? And how will Tiffany's role in the narrative continue to unfold?